This video is made upon request by one of our audience, Puja. The problem says a batter is a baseball so that it goes making an angle 53 degree with horizontal and its velocity is 37 meter per second initially. I am going to construct a figure. I am representing velocity in this direction where u initial velocity equal to 37 meter per second and it makes angle 53 degree with horizontal. Now I am resolving this velocity into two components formular components and one of the component is along the x-axis and I am writing this as ux and another is along y-axis particularly and I am writing it as uy and since it is touched by the angle so its component is u cos theta here value of u is 37 and cos angle is 53 degree upon solving we get 22.26 meter per second Similarly for u y it is given by u sin theta putting the values 37 sin 53 degree we get this value 29.54 meter per second. Now question asks us to find the position of the baseball after time t equal to 2 second. Since baseball is moving under the action of gravity only so its path is projectile motion. I am constructing a parabolic path for it. Let us say in 2 seconds it reaches up to here and here its velocity is v and its position is pxy. I am drawing another figure for its clarification and this is Cartesian coordinate system and I am picking up point p as xy. Doing this so this is x from here to here and the vertical distance is y so that it reaches up to p x y. Now I am going to solve for position. Position means you have to find the value of x y. To find x I need to take the horizontal component u x since the gravity is acting vertically so there is no effect of any force along the horizontal direction. So we can use the simple formula for velocity which is velocity equal to distance by time. Our horizontal velocity is ux, so ux equal to x by t, horizontal distance x and times t, so x equal to ux t equal to our value of ux is 22.26 times 2 equal to 44.53 meter. Similarly for ui, we need to take another formula where acceleration is involved, ut plus 1 by 2 at square. I need to convert this formula into vertical components. For vertical component, the displacement s is y equal to its velocity is now u y t time is a scalar quantity minus 1 by 2 z t square. Here acceleration is acceleration due to gravity. For sign convention, since the object is moving in upward direction, so I take u y is positive. The acceleration due to gravity is acting downward, so g is negative if u y is positive. If you take u y as negative, then you have to put g as positive. Also, the displacement is upward, so in this case, the displacement y is also positive. So, here is minus 1 by 2 g t square, it is due to acceleration due to gravity g. Equal to, let's put the values, u y equal to 29.54 times t2. 1 by 2, I take value of g as 10 into 2 square. After calculating, you get the value 39.2 meter. So, in the given condition, the position of the baseball after 2 seconds is 44.53 meter, 39.2 meter. To calculate the velocity, we have to take vertical and horizontal components. Since there is no acceleration in a horizontal direction, in projectile motion, so velocity remains constant in this direction. It means at point P, I took the velocity as V, its horizontal component is Vx and vertical component is Vy. Here Vx equal to Ux, since the horizontal component remains same, equal to 22.26 meter per second. To calculate the vertical component of velocity at point P, I choose formula B equal to U plus AT. I turn this formula into vertical components, so it becomes PY equal to UY 
and vertically the acceleration is acceleration due to gravity gt putting the values 29.54 minus 10 times 2 equal to 9.54 meter per second now to calculate the net velocity at point p b equal to bx square plus by square on the root let's plug in the values 22.26 square plus 9.54 square and root here comes the value 24.21 meter per second this is the velocity after two second at point p also for direction to calculate the direction means to calculate the angle at the given point we have 10 theta equal to p by b you can check the figure the triangle becomes like this i draw it here this angle is theta which is 53 degree and this one is uh, bx and this one is by so it is by by bx let's put the values theta equal to 10 inverse by by bx equal to 10 inverse 9.54 divided by 22.26 equal to 23.198 degree this angle is made with the horizontal with the horizontal in this way you can solve this problem thank you for watching